Hello viewers, hope you're doing well. Today in this video, I'm going to test the signup API with Postman. So let's get started. Let me open here the integrated terminal under the SRC package. And here I'm going to write the command to run the Node.js application. So the command is node space app.js. Let's hit enter. And you can see we got an error. Let me check what is the issue. Okay, so let's fix this issue. Let's go to dbconfig.js and here I'm going to update this link and it will be a mongodb colon slash slash. Let me add here the IP address. Okay, and here I'm going to add server selection timeout that is a five seconds. So let me clear the console and let's rerun the Node.js application. And you can see error removed. Let's go to Postman. Let me add here the URL of our backend application. That is http colon slash slash localhost colon 5000. And let me add here the URL of our signup route. That is a slash user. You can see. So let's go to signup route. And you can see here the URL of our register API. That is a slash register. Let me copy this and let me paste after that so the mapping that is a post let me add here the body in the type of a json so first one we have a name that is a customer second we have a email i'm going to add here and the last that is a password let me add here the password that is a customer okay so let's click on the send button to register the new user now you can see we got an error let me check that is a rest dot status is not a function i think we have added the wrong spelling of status let me check okay so let me add here the correct spelling of the status let's rerun the application let's go to postman let's click on the send button and you can see the status that is a 201 created and you can see here the created user with the name email role and you can see here the id and you can see here the message that is a user created successfully let's go to more db let me refresh the user's model and you can see here the created user with the name email and the role we can't see the password here let's check you can see here the sign up service we need to assign the hash password to our key that is a password okay so let me rerun the node.js application let's go to mongodb let me delete this created user let's go to postman let's click on the send button to create the user again and you can see user created successfully with the status 201 created and you can see here the object of the user with the name email and you can see here the password in the form of hash you can see the role id and you can see here the message that is a user created successfully let's go to mongodb let me refresh the user's model and you can see the details of the created user so let's go to postman let me create another user with the name customer1 and let me add here the email that is a customer1 at the rate test.com and the password I'm going to add here customer1 let's click on the send button and you can see user created successfully let's go to mongodb let me refresh the user's model and you can see here the second user so that's all for now from my side i hope you like this video if you have any confusion you can do comment and also subscribe to my channel for more videos and hit the bell icon thanks for watching take care bye